Hey guys, Monoboat Gaming here. Um, give me a second. I'm trying to set up my recording view here. Alright, welcome back. Um, I have something very important to say to you. Gallus got murdered. Obviously. But there's one thing I have to say. They've been framed. Gallus... Gallus' murder was framed. Alright. I, um... I, um... Let's just put it this way. Um... I'll explain a little background. So, in Thieves' Guild missions, uh, Gallus was the headmaster of the Thieves' Guild, and then the other two were, uh, Freddie Mercer, I think it was, Freddie Mercer, and, uh, Carlisle. Well, Mercer, um, framed Carlisle for murder, and she's been running for 25 years now, but, um, let's just say this. It wasn't that. It wasn't that at all. Mercer actually f killed him due to the, um, I don't know. It was really weird. It just, because what happened was, I'm just the house car. Okay, here. I'll explain it this way. Here, well, just watch this. Can I help you with anything else? Carmaya. Then she's finally found it. Do you have Gallus's journal? No problem. Let me see it. Now, oh, this is just like Gallus. A dear friend, but always too clever for his own good. He's written all of the text in the Falmer language. Really? No. However, I know someone who might. The court wizard of Markov, Selmo, may have the materials you need to get this journal translated. Word of warning, Selmo is a fierce guardian of his research. Getting the information won't be easy. I know who Calcelmo is. Calcelmo. Selmo. Calcelmo. Friggin', um, I, I talked about in the earlier episodes how I went to the College of Winterhold to finish, uh, to actually improve my magic. And, um, let's just put it this way. Um, me and Calcelmo are pretty good right now, because I'm not, I haven't done anything wrong to, for God's sake, this glitch has been going on for months now. And all it spawns is this steel mace. I don't even suck up the soul. I don't do crap. Yeah, because call Samo. I actually did have this mace at one point. I really liked it. But anyway, um, Cal Selmo, um, I helped him with his research, and um, it should be really good right now. What I thought about the College of Winterhold, I thought they were talking about the um, Archmage, but no, they're talking about the guy over at Markarth. So um, I thought Cal Selmo was the Archmage over in the College of Winterhold for a sec. But, um, no, I appear to be wrong. Um, so in Understone Keep, there should be a guy. Yeah. I've, got, I've kind of upgraded a lot for the past few days. Um, this morning I was like level 37, and now I'm level 40. And, um, I, I say that's a lot because it's mainly just been on trying to upgrade, um, Conjuration. 
my conjuration level, which I'm now like a 74. I've got another 16 levels to go before I can get the sigil stone to get Daedric armor. So, I gotta figure out how to do a lot better because I don't like this method. Because I'm running, I was running around trolls earlier. Um, use pulling out bound sword, sheathing it again, doing, uh, pulling out bound sword again, sheathing it, and then just keeping in a repeat cycle of that. Um, alright. So let's take a look at this. Um, here, let's turn this up for this part. So pretty much, um, we're gonna talk to Cal Semo. Good to see you for well in I am at this very moment on the cusp of completing my magnum opus on the sea. I'm calling it Cal Selmo's Guide to the Former Time. It will revolutionize the way we understand those ancient beings. Preposterous. That research represents years of personal toil in some of the most dangerous former ruins in Skyrim. You must be mad to think I'd allow anyone to see it before it's completed. I've already provided you a key to the museum. You should consider it an honor. I'm sorry. But that's as far as my generosity extends. I have things to study. What is it? Gain entry to Cal Semo's museum. Alright, so there should be some research in here. Over the drummer. So, Kalsamo, um, I had to slay a spider for him down in one of these ruins in order for him to continue his research. And that's why I used that sentence, even after slaying your pet's, uh, your frostbite spider, because... It's because of, uh, how he did that. Uh... Uh, obtain Kalsamo's Falmar Translating Guide. Oh, dear lord. Alright, we go into Kalsamo's laboratory. And... We have to get a hold of the book. Um, that translate the Falmar language. So, uh, yeah, it's... Alright, alright, alright. Welcome. Oh crap. Alright, I'll be back with you guys in a sec. I need to get that guide. Almost there. Really close. I am really close. I know. All right, I can't exactly inscribe it, so I have to run out of the tower. I'm really nervous right now because the the captain of the squadron just showed up along with the wizard AI guitar. I guitar.
So I gotta run to Calcelmo's lavatory again. Am I charcoal and paper? Alright, hold on, we'll be right back with him. Boo. Boo, 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 boo. Does that scare you? That's true. I, I'm not familiar with the Twilight Sepulchre. What is it? It's pretty much something about this Twilight Sepulchre. I'm sorry. 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 It's all right, Carlia. You don't have to say a word. Listen, all I want is the truth to be revealed to the guild. They respected Carlia, and she deserves better. Do whatever you can, and I'd consider it a personal favor. If trying to rid yourself of stolen goods becomes a burden and you find yourself in Winterfell, visit me at the college. I've been known to handle items of questionable interest from time to time, and I'll see what I can do. If you have further need of me, you can find me at the college. You must hasten to Riffin before Mercer can do any more damage to the guild. You've come this far, so I see no harm in concealing it any longer. The Twilight Sepulchre is the temple to my tomb. It's what the Nightingales are sworn to protect with their lives. Everything that represents my tomb's influence is contained within the walls of the Sepulchre. Now it seems Mercer's broken his oath before the time and defiled the very thing he swore to protect. I felt the same way when Gannis first revealed these things to me. I think given time I'll understand what I mean. As a Nightingale, I've been sworn to secrecy regarding the Sepulchre. I know the Guild doesn't do much to foster faith, but I'm going to have to ask that you continue to trust me. I'll make for Riften and scout the situation, see if I can discover what Mouse is up to. When you're ready, meet me at the Ragged Flame. In the end, I wanted you to have this. It belonged to Gallus, but given the circumstances, I think you'd approve. If the guild isn't willing to listen to reason, you might have to. <coughs> Wait. No. Look out for a whole circle. My. God. All right. Um. So that'd be the end of this video here today. Um. Yeah. That that was. That's pretty bad. So, sounds like Mercer broke the oath of the nineteen nightingales and spent, took uh money out of the treasury and used it for personal pleasures and um. Uh, like that's it. Um, yeah. Aster had to move away because of the empire, but we get to stay. So that's probably the end of this video. Um, I hope you guys really enjoyed that. Um, I know I did because it's freaking. That's amazing to know that Mercer that it kind of backfired on him of having him trying to kill me. Cause, yeah, because he tried to kill me, because in the end he tried to slash at me. And, uh, yeah. So I'll talk to you guys in the next video, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So, yeah. Goodbye. Peace. Have a nice day. Or, you know, have a nice night. Or whatever you, whenever you watch this video. <laughs>